Hey, Ascension, can't wait to see you Sunday. Uh, we've got Bible study in between the services at 945, Bible Project, there's women's Bible study, and, um, and then, of course, Sunday school for all ages. Uh, and then we're going to talk about uh, the time that Jesus healed the blind man, Bartimaeus. Yeah, he calls out, Lord, Jesus Christ, Son of David, have mercy on me. Uh, we're going to be calling out with him. And then we're going to encounter Jesus. And he's going to change not just huh, the world the way that we want it. He's going to change our world in the way that we look at it. So we'll receive sight just like Bartimaeus, and I can't wait to see you there on Sunday. After the second service, by the way, if you want to stick around, you can participate. You're invited to a really special little service. It's called the Blessing of a Civil Wedding. The Herzogs are remembering their 30th anniversary that way, and uh, they invite you to participate with us in a, it'll be just a brief service together. Our 2022 stewardship campaign is in full swing and it will go through November 7th. So fill out your cards and leave them at the wooden box at the back of the sanctuary. At Oktoberfest this Saturday, uh, bring some travel-sized toiletries because Project Outpour will be there and uh, we can make donations and learn about the cause. And we're celebrating the 90th anniversary of Ascension on Reformation Sunday. So in between the services, we will be celebrating uh, no Sunday school. Uh, so yeah, come join us. Yeah, and at the 90th anniversary celebration, uh, we're going to be blessing all this great work that's been done on campus. I have a ribbon cutting and give thanks to God for it. Uh, we'll also have a historical demonstration about these 90 years of ministry at Ascension. In fact, some of the folks from Ascension's past will be present. Uh, pastor Furking, the son of the founding pastor here at Ascension will be with us. And it'll be a great day for celebrating and rejoicing in all that God's done here. It'll also be Reformation Day, so you can wear red that day and remember that celebration. And if you bring a canned good or diapers, you can support the new food pantry that's opened up on campus. We had our soft opening on Monday. Uh, we fed eight families, 24 weeks worth of groceries uh, for all of the people at their households. They were so grateful and we're so grateful to be able to be part of something, another way to, to serve our community along the lines of the great soup kitchen that we have on Tuesdays. Uh, that pantry is open on Mondays and Fridays, and if you know people in need, please be sure to refer them to Loaves and Fishes or to, uh, to us so that we can sign them up. And the Hymnal Meets Jazz is Friday, November 5th, and the benefits from that go to Project Outpour. There's still time to sign up and get a spot. And finally, that next weekend is All Saints Sunday, where we remember the names of departed loved ones, especially from this past year. Uh, if you have loved ones who have died in the past year, would you let us know in the office? Uh, we would like to include them in the celebration that day because we know where they are. They're with the Lord.